Oh, what's happening, good people? Let's have a conversation real quick. Me and my, my nephew was chopping it up, right? We was talking about, I don't know how we got on the subject, but we was talking about hair. Because uh, I think I sent him a video of a, of a dude that apparently had part of his locks fall out and it was dyed. And he was showing how I don't do it. Don't, 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 don't put all the chemicals in your hair, whatever the case may be. And he pulled it apart. And so that got us just a spinning and talking. And uh, my, my, cause my nephew and my son got two strand twists that they swear they're going to let lock up. But we'll see. I don't think either one of them got the patience to allow it to just lock up without wanting to play with it and manipulate and retwist and all this other uh, books that they got going on right now when it comes to the lock market. But anyway, they got me talking about uh, some people giving the advice. There's a lot of the old heads. I say old heads, but I, I hope they're not in my generation. I think they're generation before me, but because I don't hear too many people my age talk about it. But talking about not washing your freeform locks or your locks for months at a time. This lady talking about though that she wash her hair three times a year. You know what, lady? That's good on you. Cause there ain't no way in the entire hell that I could be able to go a week without washing my hair. I've tried it. And I end up driving myself nuts with all the scratching and itching and everything else that go on. Cause my hair gets extra oily. And all that build up and see not build up really is sebum. The natural oil. I produce a lot of it in my head. And to just let that just sit there on my scalp for three, four months at a time, just it's not feasible for me. So, here's Stu's advice. Anybody out there starting or wanting to look at starting this journey, listen to me. I've tried it all, man, when I first started. I started it off out of the military, so my hair was real short. I didn't know which direction I was going, so I tried all this shit. And my sister-in-law put, uh, what was it, coconut oil? I think it was coconut oil in my hair to try to start my locks. Boy, that shit drove me crazy. Within two days, I rinsed it all out, and I ain't turned back. Right? I rinsed it all out, washed my hair in a circular motion, and then when I rinsed it in cold water, I continued the same circular motion every single time. And this is the byproduct. You ain't got to do all this stuff, man. Y'all be trying to do too much. And you're taking the freedom out of the freeform locks, baby. Just, just keep it simple. We ain't got to do all this, right? So just keep it simple. I wash my hair once a week if I can stand it that long. But I rinse it probably two or three times a week with just cold water right before I get out the shower just to get all that extra stuff out of my head that I don't want in there. And then when I do wash it, I wash it in hot water, rinse it in cold. And if I feel the need, I, I hit a couple little drops of uh, essential oils in there, rub it around, massage it around in there to make sure it's distributed evenly. Whatever extra I may have on my palm, I just run it through my hair so my hair ain't so dry and brittle. That'll stop all this breakage y'all going through. And y'all, everybody trying to look like Lil Dirt. And you're going to end up looking like Lil Wayne or Stevie or damn Snoop. Y'all might want to look him up. Because that's the thing I challenge my nephew to do. And he still ain't produced me one picture, nephew, or one video, nothing, of somebody with freeform blocks having a lock just fall out from thinning and breakage. It ain't going to happen. That's like saying a tree just going to fall over outside without it being diseased. Freeform locks don't go through all that manicured, pretty boy, pretty girl stuff that y'all be going through. You better stop it and be free. Holler at me, nephew. I'm still waiting on my video on my pictures. I ain't forgot about you.